Welcome aboard Martians. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back at you with an update on the latest and greatest on the Dogalon Mars token. That is ticker symbol E-L-O-N. Definitely drop a like on this video to help spread the promotion of Dogalon Mars. Help everybody invested. And also consider subscribing to stay up to date and ahead of the game on cryptocurrency news and all things Dogalon Mars. And also to win some amazing NFTs. I do these giveaways every single week. I bring NFTs to this channel and I give them away to lucky subscribers that comment on the videos come Monday through Friday. I'm actually going to be holding a very special NFT giveaway as soon as I hit 2,000 subscribers. So all you got to do is be subscribed and I uh, will be doing a giveaway come 2,000 subscribers. Thank you guys for tuning in and helping me get that far. I definitely appreciate you all. All right, looking at the day, I mean, look at this. Gotta let you know I'm not a financial advisor. Nothing I say is financial advice, but our day is looking pretty well. I mean, we did take a little dive into the 7300 range, it appears, and I think that was our bottom. Uh, 7365 was our bottom, and we have bounced since then. Are in the 7459 range and uh not too bad not bad overall i mean the whole market dived overnight it just seemed like uh and, and dog on mars actually held held its own pretty well i'm gonna have to say that looking at our holders let's see how we have fared over the last day i mean we were at 131 yesterday 131.04 and we have increased uh little over 60 70 holders there and that that's very nice in just the last day that that is very very nice to see um so i mean if, if we judge that over the week we have about 70 holders that that's about 100 and uh what uh, uh that's a pretty close to under 700 a week uh, that's not bad that's not bad at all Getting into an analysis, we do have 41% of people in the money. Not bad. It is not dropping too bad, considering most people probably are lo have loaded up in this 6-0 price range. Um, not bad at all. I'm glad to see that. We do have a lot of good news, though, so stay tuned in for that. Let's take a look at the Investor Observer analysis. That does get into giving Dogalon Mars a moderate risk gauge a very strong short-term technical of 76 uh this is a pretty high volatility score but i imagine it's just because of the market we normally sit somewhere in the middle here in about 20 um, sometimes we do get into that little higher range just depending on how the project is performing we do have 4.75 million traded over the last 24 hours and we do have 31.34 million traded over the last week and we do have a circulating supply of one quadrillion and uh let me know do you guys think that there may be a burn uh, mechanism implemented here in the future i i do see that as a strong potential for this project uh if not then they are going to pull out some uh pretty cool things but i don't think that i definitely know that they the the project developers have understood that a high circulating supply would lead to a lower price overall and i'm sure that is just how they want it to be for a lot of people to get in and let, let me know what you guys are thinking how do you feel about uh the circulating supply because i do get that comment a lot in the comments and um i, I don't want to touch on it in the comments i'd rather do a video on it and see um how, how the people feel about this project all right so let's get into some good stuff as you know uh half of the liquidity is stored with the methuselah foundation so i feel it only appropriate to find out some news on this on this itself so let's get into right now people are noticing the difference of dog on mars and this was made two days ago i'm a little late on this one but i i wanted to bring this to you guys so i'm just dropping it in today a new report asks whether investors should bank on cryptos that are trying to make an impact. Buzz is already building around the idea of crypto philanthropy or donating cryptocurrencies to worthy causes. A new article in Digital Journal suggests that crypto, which is changing how com commerce is conducted, may soon begin transforming how the larger world works as well. We're proud that the example in cities uh, is Dogalon Mars, c 
collaboration with Methuselah Foundation to send a prize-winning vascular tissue science experiment to the ISS, where investigations can proceed with the gravity of Earth. This is a critical first step toward the interplanetary space travel. The Digital Journal article discusses the emergence of crypto donations platforms like the Giving Block, which raises raised more than a hundred million last year, and the new token Seesaw Protocol SSW Education Pot, which will fund educational institutions around the world. In some ways, SSW, which is in pre-sale now, is becoming a mission token like Dog on Mars, just as the Elon community voted to pay to send the vascular tissue experiment to the ISS SSW holder will vote on the education pot funds which will be allocated ensuring a democratic and transparent process as the largest holders of Elon are thrilled that people are noticing that the power of this token and its ultimate value comes from the strength and singular vision of the dog on Mars community as we've said before we don't see Elon the same way that a big holder might a big holder wants to turn a profit as quickly as possible we are committed to being stewards of the token and intend to be in elon for the long run we view our role as advocating the community and encouraging support for focused projects and that brings us to the real point doggle on mars is a mission token that brings a community together around a higher person purpose or ultimate mission but we believe in higher a higher calling to promote innovation that can change humanity for the better. It's gratifying to see that people are recognizing the power of cryptocurrency to bring about real change in the world, and that our role in doing that is getting noticed. If you'd like to see the transformation, become a donor of the Methuselah Foundation. And this is huge. This is huge. I mean, not only does the ISS and NASA I pretty much promote dog on Mars and have done business with them. I mean that if that doesn't tell you something there, I don't know what will. But this project really does is one of the first of its kind that I mean really has brought a community together around a mission rather than just a meme and uh I mean, it, it is still a fun project. Don't get me wrong. I still have very much fun doing these videos, but the mission is pretty serious. I mean, keeping keeping humans alive and trying to keep um, lives um, more higher quality, higher level. I mean, this this is big stuff. You can go check this out at mfoundation.org and uh, kind of see what they get into. But I mean, they have done some groundbreaking research, uh, new tissue regeneration of a very very amazing stuff that that is going on in the dog on mars community and it, it's all part to to you as an investor investing in the project like this so i mean I, i'm gonna bring to this last here dog on mars price prediction can it hit 100 uh one cent in 2022 and i mean it it does get in and we are fairly bullish as a community i mean it, it is really nice and it gets down to um I think uh, the the most important part was that any breach in the level could bring uh, bring bears enough momentum to push it down 50% in the in the coming days. But also, uh, if we can break higher than five zeros one one five, can give enough momentum to hit the five zeros two level by the end of the year. Many investors are aiming for a target like one cent in price. I mean that I definitely just wanted to let you guys know that uh we may actually be seeing some very nice movement in the coming days if the if the bulls can get a hold of this project we are going to see some very very nice movement and uh hopefully this news in all of um in this world news can actually pan out and the markets can recover and then we should see a very nice recovery in doggle on mars i mean patience is going to be golden in this situation absolutely golden and yeah uh hopefully you guys are doing your due diligence out there researching the project and uh yeah just in the meantime i mean there i can't wait to see what prices are looking at this summer I mean, if you're watching all the way to the end please drop what you think the prices are going to look like come june july maybe even may 
in the end of the year and and if you are watching this far i definitely appreciate you more than you know thank you very much for tuning in and i will catch you all on mars